As high-tech military gear goes, this helmet is about as futuristic as it gets. It's designed for pilots in the Eurofighter Typhoon. It knows which target the pilot's looking at and which one he wants to shoot down first. The helmet was developed by British defence company BAE Systems. Their chief test pilot, Mark Bowman, says the development is revolutionary. We've moved on uh, enormously from where we were 20 or 30 years ago. The helmet display is as most probably significant as almost uh, the jet engine in what it's going to do for uh, combat capability and what the pilot can, uh, can do. A heads-up display is nothing new, but this one's inside the visor and moves with the pilot's head, effectively making him part of the weapons system. The pilot can now look at a target, even if it's behind or below him, lock onto it, and then fire, regardless of where the aircraft is pointing. Yeah, clearly, traditionally, the helmet has been seen very much as a crash helmet and a, and a, and a walkie-talkie. What we've got now is actually a, a piece of not only optical equipment, but something that's really technically advanced that most probably I, certainly as a young boy, only ever dreamt of, but now it's very much a reality. The Eurofighter Typhoon recently completed its first 100,000 hours of service with air forces across Europe. Its next 100,000 will see the integration of the helmet system, an advance destined to take split-second decision-making to new heights. Stuart McDill, Reuters, Lancashire.